Well, hello everybody and welcome back. It is Jeff again, and I seem to have made a horrible mistake. Let me show you. Basically, I have the problem where if I go into the nether, I die pretty instantly. So, here's the deal. What happened was, and I have a sword, I mean, what happened was this little pit that I originally had my cows in. A little baby zombie pigman had wandered his way in there and went down there. And I decided to kill him because he was the only one in the room, I thought. Apparently another one had spawned and was in this room. And since I killed him over in here, this guy came charging after me, teleported himself to the nether, and I thought that was it. I didn't realize that he had really done that. I was like, okay, no big deal. And the next time I went to the nether, it just angered everything. I lost so much stuff. It took me about an hour of just running in and dying, running in and dying to actually try to collect some of my stuff, which I managed to successfully do. Got pretty much everything, only lost a little teeny bit, uh, things that weren't as important, but some of my quartz that I still want some of the quartz. So... The problem is, I'm now stuck, and I can't do anything in the nether. I had thought I had cleared it up. I did some running around, escaped my... I went in through BTC's portal, actually. Ran real fast away. Oh, God, I just got myself confused at where I'm supposed to be going. I think I'm supposed to be going this way. No, no, it's this way. They changed this, like, road, so it really throws me off now. Directly this way should be spawn but i haven't run it in a long time as well as since i'm not loading the world very well um yeah it's directly this way but the road is not loading so hang tight everybody okay we're back and the main problem that i'm having now is i i had successfully gotten the pigmen not angry i ran really far away um and I guess there was a random one. I don't know exactly how the hostility works with them. Because I guess there was a random pig man somewhere around. And when I went back in, I was fine for a while. And I started to walk through the nether. And I must have tripped him. Which everybody started to get just extremely angry. Oh my god. Oh my god. Somebody's working on the nether. And... Okay. And it was a baby. Okay. From what I understand... If you wait long enough, they will no longer be aggro. This looks really good. Somebody's actually working on this. They will no longer be... So they won't have a speed boost, but they'll still be angry unless... Until you die. But it's like with the... Or if you get outside of a 40 block radius. But apparently pigmen killing you doesn't count as you dying. Because... If the pigmen kill you, then they're still angry when you come back in. But I, what I had done was I had gone, I had run really far away. When the pigmen were angry with me, I like jumped into the lava or something like that uh, once they stopped having their speed boost. And then when I came back in, nobody was mad until I went and found apparently that one pigman who then called over all of his friends. Like I didn't even touch him. I just ran by him and all of a sudden he was like, hey, there's that guy again. And they came after me. So, so now, if, as you notice, everybody's angry with me. They're all still following me. But they no longer should have a speed boost. And in theory, if I kill myself, which I can't use the kill command on the server. But I think if I can kill myself by just taking fall damage. I don't have any idea if that's going to have worked, though. The nether's, like, off limits to me. Okay. See, they're angry again. And now they're all going to be at my house and angry. Why are these guys all so angry with me still? And the problem is... Oh, crap. I didn't bring any blocks with me, so therefore I can't close this off because they're falling in from the ceiling. And now this guy's going to be at my house, and yep, he's going to kill me like right there at my house, which is going to be right by my bed. This is the circle that I've been... Oh, Jesus. I've been running around for a while. Well, that guy's... No, no, no. He's going to be in the portal. Ah, oh, crap. One of them's in the portal. I can... If I can kill this guy... Okay. There is a couple of them outside. I hope that they're not mad. 
This guy in here is going to be angry. I'm going to try to clear him out, though. Yeah, see, now the problem is that guy is in my base on the other side, and I can't even go in here and sit with nothing until I kill him. Okay, hopefully I can get him dead in the next one, and then I'll be able to just go box that area in and take another look, because I don't know what to do. It's really frustrating. Okay, he is dead. Let me get out of here quickly get blocks. I want to block this off so no pigmen can get in here anymore. I guess I could do it with dirt. Um, I was looking for... Oh, there it is. Cobble. Because they were falling in from the ceiling, which was causing one of the major problems. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. My phone. My phone. Hold on. Hold on, folks. Ugh. Okay. I think this is now to a point where nothing else is going to be able to get in here. I don't know if I can just wait it out in here or not. We'll find out, so bear with me. All right, everybody, so I waited it out for a while. All these pigmen are around me, and they are angry, and I forgot to turn my mic back on, so I'm doing a little bit of post-recording in the middle of this thing, so leave the nether real quick. I'm going to go get some, drop my supplies off, because what I want to do is I want to actually jump off the edge into the lava, kill myself now that I spent enough time. So I don't want to have all my supplies that die with me, not that I really had much. I just need to make sure I can break out of the wall. So I'm going to have to make a pickaxe really quick and then jump toward death. So hang tight. Okay, I've gone back into the nether. I waited again just in case they got re-angry before... Um, when I come back into the nether and waited about a minute and then I jumped into the lava. And now that we've jumped into the lava, hopefully things are good. So, big men are still extremely angry. That didn't help at all. I'm at a loss for what to do at this point. Okay, I might have done it. I was on top of that pillar. I waited for like five minutes. I jumped and ran. <sighs> Obviously, I didn't do it. That's weird. I jumped and ran into this little tunnel that was built in the nether hub. And I ran all the way to the end of it after blocking the pigment off. And I thought I would be far enough away. But it is definitely not. This guy's going to kill me. And now I just made everybody angry again. Whoa. Hi, buddy. I don't know where you came from, but you're not angry with me. He wasn't even angry with me. Wait. 
Is no one angry or is just nobody here? Um, I want to go back to spawn. Before I dig this stuff out. I don't have that pick anymore. Oh my god. Um, let me make this pick. Put these in my bar. Get this aligned. I might be okay. Okay, these guys aren't angry. These guys aren't angry. Let me break this pillar down. I might have to pillar up to do it, but I don't want it to look all bad. There we go. There might be that baby in there who's angry. Now, the main problem is these guys are going to be angry with me. The ones that are at spawn. I hope this baby's not... I don't think he exists anymore. Okay, he doesn't seem to exist anymore. And therefore is not angry. Oh my god. Have I possibly saved face with this whole thing? Minus the guys that are going to be at the spawn area and angry that I probably just need to kill. I need to ensure that no aggressive work in progress jet. Nice. Uh, that no aggressive guys are going to make their way back into the portal. Whoa. Okay, they're not aggressive either, but there's <laughs> hundreds of them on the loose. Okay. I might be okay. That took forever. Now let's do one more thing to see. So what happened last time is I thought I had fixed everything. I didn't think anybody was angry with me anymore. I need to go get some food before I make this journey though. And I was going to that place where I got the cows from only because I knew there was quartz over there. Not that I necessarily have to go that far, but in order to test this whole hypothesis and see if I'm actually safe or not, I think I want to venture back out there because that's where I, everybody was fine around here, around spawn, but there happened to be some angry dude still. I'm going to bring a sword. I'm going to bring my food. I don't know where I left the food. I want to say not in there. I had a bunch of potatoes. There they are. Let me just grab half of them in case. And I'll show you exactly where this all went down. And man, it sucked that I lost so many levels. What? <laughs> Guys, I don't know. I don't know what to do. Look at them. They're coming out of the woodwork. seem to be actually coming after me. I mean, that guy kind of does. Where are they? I don't understand if... Are they getting on top of... Are they getting on top? Hey, 
It's basically that all these there's all these ones that were spawned. And when a new hostile one is coming into the area, I'm like gonna have to kill every single pigman that I, it's not gonna be possible for me to actually do. Cause I mean, look at these random ones that are. Really afraid. Yeah, cause these guys are. They're definitely trying to get in here. Yeah, they're definitely on top. Dive bombing for the suicide. I mean, maybe that's good. Maybe I can make them dive bomb for a suicide. I wish they killed themselves still and didn't have actual... Well, they're not even dying, though, because they don't die in the lava. So now there's just a bunch of angry guys down below. I'm at a loss, everybody, for what I should be doing to remedy this situation right now. I mean, look at him. He's, they're coming in from the ceiling. That guy killed me. All my stuff probably just went over the edge. What a video of just death after death after death. And look at, they're all just angry again. Okay. I try to swim in lava to escape zombie pigmen. Maybe that will be enough to trigger safety. Definitely not enough to trigger safety. Nope. Nope, I think I need the assistance of like every minecracker in existence to come in here and help me just kill everyone. That's the only way I think this is gonna be possible is to literally go through and kill all angry zombie pigmen. <coughs> Y'all are so angry. I should go get a pick again. Might be better just to run. I don't know. Okay, we got those ones dead. Can we get... The ones down there seem to have despawned. Who broke my glass? And gave a way for all these pigmen to re-enter. You're a jerk. I don't like you. And I can't fix it right now. Um... I could break this glass and get out of here. I can go back in through the main portal and just run down that corridor again. And kill everything in sight. Until everybody is dead. I mean, that's like the only... The only real viable option that I have. Yes, I know you guys are probably like, Put on some armor, damn it! You should have armor on to do this. But I, I mean, right now I'm just kind of in the in the testing phase of whether this is actually even feasible or not. Let me meet you guys back at the main spawn area. Because these, the pigmen that are there still shouldn't be mad at me, but I have no idea for, for real. So I'll meet you guys back over at the main spawn area and we will see what to do. Man, what a horrible, horrible horrible mistake that I have made and do not know how to remedy at this time. Okay, going in again. Iron sword this time. I didn't put on any... Shoot, I should have. Okay. Here we go. 
We get some of these guys out here. I did bring a pick. Grab all this stuff. When I don't need to use the iron sword, I won't. Okay. Trying to kill everybody who's hostile. Which is a lot of them. And I don't know if it's just like making more and more and more angry, which it is. I don't I don't know. I don't know, guys. I don't know what to do anymore. It just makes me sad. I'm gonna put out a plea to people to protect me, to save me, to make me able to traverse the nether again. I don't know, everything that I've read online is just literally saying that you have to, you just have to kill them. Just gotta kill them all. But, it doesn't seem to be working in the aspect that it also says that, it, what it says is anywhere between like 29 and 40 seconds, they should stop their speed boost. And at that point, if you die, or if you get outside of a 40 block radius of them, that they will no longer be angry. Now, I don't know if while they are angry, if you get out of that 40 block radius of them, or if you get killed, because I got killed way far in the nether, maybe those guys didn't forget about me for some reason. And, like, it's weird that sometimes some of the pigmen are fine, and sometimes that they're all just angry. And uh, these guys are going to be pretty angry. I need to, like, run, block myself off in that hole. Like, right when I joined this, because, yep, yeah, here's all the angry guys. And they're angry, angry this time, so I need to grab iron. I got my iron, which is good. I have to make sure I'm running. So these holes in the nether are just not as safe as I hoped. So let's go this way. Put it like this. Hopefully nothing will come behind me. Let's just seal that off. So I can see just in case, but I kill everything who comes this way. I wish I could one shot kill them. If I got a sword that was good enough to one shot kill, it might actually be very helpful because it wouldn't be angering more pigmen. This guy's a strong one. Okay, unfortunately, I don't own my pick anymore, so I can't really dig into the wall. I need to see if I'm getting. More people angry, or if this is just the same old angry ones. There's a lot of places they can be coming in from at this point, because there's so many holes in the wall. That guy's still angry up there. I want him to... Okay, this guy's coming still. Okay. Okay, I got him. I want to get this guy. Okay. Okay, there's obviously guys coming in from these areas. Now, is are other people still mad? Let's get all this stuff. Okay. See, I, I don't know if that's just calling. I think that's just calling more pigment is what that's doing. Okay. So this is a lot of them. Okay, so let's do that. Back to safety. Back to a stone sword. Just so I don't waste this iron sword. Yes, this is a an episode of me getting destroyed by pigmen in a way that I don't know if I can I, I don't know if I can come back from this. I could make like a a redstone Why is that guy stuck there again? Baby zombie. Piece of crap. Okay. I don't like that guy being over there. I don't know why you're stuck on this wall like that. Okay. 
Looks clear. Looks clear-ish. Actually, I can't tell. It's a workbench, okay. There's you. And I think that just angered more of them. There's obviously more coming down these stairs. I just need to stay in a, a spot where... Oh, shoot. I can't, uh... I can't sprint. Crap. I'm gonna get over to my hole again. Okay. I need to eat. I didn't bring too much stuff, so it's not just going to be sitting here. Let's just eat this. See, look look how slowly they're now walking. I mean, in theory, that being the case, if I can get them all to, like, to hoard here, and I just run this way, I think it's spawn up there. As long as I run at least 40 blocks, in theory, those guys shouldn't be angry anymore. But I don't know if that's all of them. This is definitely 40 blocks away. I know this is a really dark video, guys, so I apologize because I'm stuck in the nether with angry pigmen everywhere. I, I can see I can hear them above me already just re-angering. How did one get in this tunnel? Did he spawn here? See, there, here's a problem. He did. He spawned in here. And now he's after me. That's just going to have made these guys angry again, right? Did they despawn? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Nope, they didn't despawn. They were just, like, doing a conga line over there. It looks like you're trying to protect me, kind of. Look at all these guys. Let's just... Let's kill them. I mean, they can't respawn that fast, right? I don't know pigment spawning ratios. Please, just be everybody. Please, just be everybody. I'm gonna break this sword, but it's okay. I have these enchanted swords. I wonder what that enchanted golden sword is that I got. Sharpness 2. Let's use it. Why not? It's gonna go away quick, but... I think the quicker I can clear you guys out before you start respawning. I see there's more. There's another guy that respawned. Okay. Now the question is, did that cause more to get angry? Did that clear them all out? I don't know the answer. There's nothing going on that way. As I started to walk upstairs... I don't hear angry zombie pigmen. Doesn't mean they don't exist. This guy's not mad. These guys aren't mad. They were out of the zone of being able to get angry with me and get called. The question is, what about this guy? My portal looks safe. These guys are angry though. Okay, guys, I don't know what to do. I, I just can't deal with these pigmen anymore. I might just have to, like, dig in the walls of the nether 
in a safe, secluded area in hopes that I get the quartz and stuff that I want until I can figure this out. Thanks for watching. My epic fail. I'll see you guys next time.